Now, first alert weather with Chief Meteorologist Tom Messner. Oh, it's great that it's going to be a third time for L.A., but a third time for Lake Placid? Uh, it would be nice. I'm yes. not sure the infrastructure is there, but it certainly would be cool. It would be cool if it happened. <laughs> well, they talk about it. Sometimes they talk about sharing it in part with Montreal. Montreal, and some other exactly, areas, so. and International Olympics. It would be great, that's for sure. Hey, let me show you what we're doing for temperatures here. Talk about great. What a day today. Just absolutely beautiful. Tons of sun. We had a couple of high clouds here and there. And that was about it. I think tomorrow more clouds around. So enjoy the 78 we're looking at in Burlington right now. Come on up the road. St. Albans 77. Hyde Park at 72. Plattsburgh right now 73. We've got a 76 in Springfield. So temperatures have gone down just a little bit. And right now Bennington it is 76 degrees as well. Hey, I got to take you to Norwich University. So I'm looking around uh, on some of the webcams that we have. I'm not exactly sure what's going on here, but some major party is happening and I'm a little bummed out I didn't get an invite. Check it out. By the way, I think they're riding a bull in the middle there. Isn't this funny? That is cool. Great day for whatever it is you guys are doing there in Northfield. Storm Tracker, we're looking around. We may see a couple of raindrops in St. Lawrence County. I think that's about it. Over towards Springfield, I mean, it could happen, but that's about it. It looks a little more feisty just south of Syracuse now. We've got a thunderstorm to the east of Syracuse between there and Albany. There's a thunderstorm as well, but that stuff's not going to be a bother for us. All right, let's bring you up to speed with the tropics. As you know, there's a hurricane out there. This is Jose. Winds right now 75 miles an hour continues to kind of move the wrong way and then it's going to do the old turnaround here and it's going to make its way closer to the East Coast than it is right now. Forecasters saying mm, don't think it's going to make landfall, but you can expect some pretty rough conditions right along the shoreline here. So by next Monday, still 70 mile an hour winds offshore. So we'll watch that for you. Don't think it's going to be a bother for us, but again, you never know. Fog first thing tomorrow morning is going to burn off. Clouds and sunshine, we've got the chance for a rain shower or two around. Likelihood is not great, and I think most of those occurring south of, say, Plattsburgh and Burlington. It is going to be a pretty warm day, up to 80 degrees again. This is Futurecast. I'll show you why I'm thinking that this stuff is going to be to the south. 9 o'clock tonight, we look fine. We'll take you right through the overnight. And here comes your Thursday here. I do think the farther north you are tomorrow, the brighter it is going to be out there on the flip side. More clouds on down to the south. We'll get you into the afternoon commute because the morning drive is going to be just fine. This is five o'clock. Here are your chances for a few showers while we're seeing sunshine. Burlington, Plattsburgh and then points to the north and that includes a lot of Franklin County, uh, New York and Vermont for that matter. Also St. Lawrence County, but that chance for showers in eastern Vermont, southern Essex County is there in the evening time and then the stuff for the most part goes away. Maybe a shower to lingering into the morning on Friday down to the south. Now on Friday, all in all, more clouds than sunshine with the exception of parts of northern New York. And again, maybe a shower or two and that'll do it. Partly cloudy tonight, patchy fog expected late for many of us away from the Champlain Valley. 60 degrees for a low tonight. Tomorrow, sun and clouds, just the chance for a few scattered showers around. 77 in Plattsburgh, Malone at 78, Newcomb, high temperature 73, same thing Tomorrow in northern Vermont, 80 degrees, Burlington, 78, Chelsea could find a few showers mixed with sun and clouds. I think a better chance for a few showers as we come on down to the south, perhaps in Lebanon, where it's going to be 80, 77 in Arlington, more clouds, generally speaking, on down to the south. Five day forecast, 80 to 80, few showers tomorrow. That chance is there on Friday, but I think Thursday stands a better chance for a couple more showers. Saturday, Sunday, I like the weekend. Mix of sun and clouds, 82, 81. Monday looks good. Sun and clouds, 80. Even Tuesday, Wednesday look good. Note a little bit cooler with highs those days in the mid-70s.